So the Bible says that Adam and Eve, after they were, you know, cast out of the garden, they made aprons for themselves. And the aprons is the pubic hair, which means that basically, which means that basically when, um, when they had sex and they realized that they were naked, <coughs> what had happened was the serpent had realized that he could use Adam to help him impregnate the woman. And the way it worked was that the woman usually conceives by the most intense orgasm, which you know, comes from the woman's anus, pretty much the same as a man. So what happened was <clears throat> the serpent, he didn't have any arms. Or maybe he did and they were just real short. But he, he he was unable to, you know, the vagina is only used for the final ejaculation. But before then, you know, these women are pretty much like, um, you know, they're just like dudes. That's why a lot of women get with other women because, you know, um, a lot of men have been, have gone, or either they get with men who've gone to prison, but there are certain men like myself who don't know these things, and so they're unable to um, to fulfill the needs of these women. So these women get another woman who knows this, that they don't have to explain it to, or they get a man who's been in prison, who's been oriented in, you know, the ends, literal ends and outs of animal sex. So <clears throat> the Bible says, he, he let the vineyard out to husbandmen. The husbandman was Adam, the Lord God. Lit the vineyard out. The vineyard was what? The garden to Adam. And Adam was uh, just like Eve, you know, but they say his first wife said that, you know, you know, who she was, you know, their their attitudes changed. <clears throat> so, that, so they were, you know, the, the Bible refers to them as being different people. But it's the same person, different attitude. Like even when Cain killed Abel, it's like, you know, he had a new name. His name was Seth or Set when Satan comes. But is why the Bible says uh, he let the vineyard out and the husbandman, he wanted the first fruits, which meant that they, you know, they're supposed to have children. But um, while, while, while the serpent was teaching Adam, or, you know, both of them together, all three threesome, he was teaching Adam how to get into uh, Eve's anus. He was going to use Adam's uh, <clears throat> involvement in her anus to implant his seed, the serpent seed, inside of Eve's vagina. As if, I don't know, saying like, you know, he didn't want to be in her anus. He didn't want to be there or he didn't know to be there. So, you know, as it is, though, it seems that, uh, <laughs> it seems that, uh, he used, he used that. And the, the child was, I've gotten a man from the Lord. You know, the serpent was, a, he was Lord. He was like a snake. He was Lord, you know, from the serpent's root come the cockatoos and the fire flying serpent. But the Bible says it's easy for a camel to walk through the, a camel or a gay male to walk through the eye of a needle. The eye of a needle is like the anus. Then it's for a rich man or a man who's, you know, well endowed, who's like, you know, has a large, large penis. It's easy for a camel or a gay male to walk through the eye of a needle than for a rich man at the end of the kingdom of heaven. And it also says, too, that, uh, it also says, too, that, uh, they made aprons. Like how they have needles. The needle was, you know, the pains with the needle. You know what I'm saying? And, and the, the eye of a needle. Oh, wow. Easy for a camel to walk through the eye of a needle. Like saying that in the symbol for the male, it's a point or a needle point, but it's a loop or an eyelet in the back. Like the man and the woman are the same. They both have an anus of the cross between a man and a woman. You know what I'm saying? is both their anuses. So when a man and a woman are basically pleasing each other with anal sex, then they are joined at the cross. It's not for me. Not for me. I've just been indoctrinated otherwise. And the practicality of that just doesn't really suit me too well, according to my comprehension. Peace, peace.